They're the same in almost every way. But is their vocal ability identical too? A new study at the University of Melbourne is using twins to investigate whether singing talent is inherited. Basically, when we were five, mum just put a guitar in our hands and yeah, we just started singing. And 15-year-olds Yasmin and Yolanda haven't stopped since. While their voices are similar, Yolanda says she has the edge. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I'm just a little bit stronger. My voice is a little bit more developed. Yeah. You don't have to think too hard to come up with well-known twins or families who share a vocal gift. Aussie duo The Veronicas, the famous Jacksons, or Beck and Sebastian who recently featured on The Voice. But until now, nobody has looked at whether their vocal ability was actually genetic. A lot of anecdotal evidence. Um, but nothing that's been done objectively to actually assess this. Professor Sarah Wilson says there are obvious environmental factors that do influence someone's singing, such as parental encouragement, but was the brain wired to understand pitch from the beginning? Basically what we want to know is does that network develop over time with training and practice and, and you know, in, encouragement in the environment, or is this something that's there to begin with? Uh, are there differences in experts versus non-experts that are genetically determined? Twins of all ages, both identical and not, are invited to get online and take part in the study, which includes recording one singing into the computer and doing pitch exercises. And although the sets of twins chosen to launch the study were certainly easy on the ear, the university wants twins of all vocal abilities to take part. So the broader the range, the better we're able to tease these things apart. So even if people think they're terrible singers, we'd love you to take part. We're the only ones who are going to be listening to it. <laughs> Let's hope the study identifies genes as playing a part. It'll give many of us the perfect excuse for singing inability.